Prodigy. And the other is Noah Fox. Noah Fox. Noah Fox. Noah Fox. Used to be Cisco Kid. Yeah, previ the artist formerly known as... The artist formerly known as Cisco Kid. As Cisco Kid. Now known as Noah Fox. Noah Fox. Uh, and yeah. So... Despite the tag change, he still rocks Toon Link. Yeah, still plays Toon Link. I think he did want to play did. Fox just to match his tag for a little bit later, but that have... was but that was not the purpose for the tag change. Yeah, he might have a secondary Fox. I know he's messed around with them every once in a yeah. while, but but Toon Link is his muse. Not not to make too much of a pun on Muse. Oh the Toon god, Link that's really Oklahoma. funny because he's also using he also uses yeah he's the using same Muse's skin. Yeah. skin. Used to play Green Toon Link, dude. I remember one time. Ooh, I love we... the bomb recatch. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, we teamed at like one of the Shockwave grapevines, and we almost beat like Dakpo Denti or something. Dang, that's crazy. Oh no, it was Denti Aerolink. We almost beat them. That's crazy. And I was like, we should team forever, and then we like never did ever again. <laughs> and it was sad. But uh, yeah, he got uh, top eight uh, at a uh, couple Shockwaves ago. Yeah. I think it was at 154. It was very recent. Mm -hmm. Oh no! Great DI to stay on the stage because he was definitely off stage when he got paired, and he DI'd back on. Yeah. That, that could have been an entire stock turnaround, but because of that moment of uh, awareness by cool. Noah Fox, he's still strongly holding on to this lead and instead it's, and, of the huge swing. And the thing about him, by the way, is that his bomb conversions have always been super crisp. He has always had those down pat. Yeah. Not only that, his his bomb play in general is pretty solid. He's been doing a lot of like throw bomb and immediately catch it with fair, so he pressures the shield of fair and then throws the bomb for more pressure and mm -hmm. then has a follow-up. Like His pressure with the bomb is pretty insane. Oh! It, speaking of insane, that uh, jab forward smash was a pretty nice setup. Yeah, jab somehow getting under the Zare. It looked like maybe Noah Fox started a little bit too high. Okay, back throw to get him off stage. Mm -hmm. But no follow-up there. That double jump can be a little bit ambiguous as to where you're going to go sometimes. Oh, the Nair wow. train? That Hello? was actually insane. All right, he's putting on a lot of damage on Little Prodigy. He's got to be more than satisfied with this stock. Yes. Even if he loses this one now. Woo. And the bomb just going to add it on more. And he's sitting at 130, but... Uh, he was almost completely vertical when he used that uh, Zare yeah. to recover. That's hilarious. I didn't think that he could tether from there. A bomb to up B Oh my to goodness, kill? and it kills. That's crazy. I feel like good DI, he might have been able to live mm. as Yoshi. There were no sparks, and Yoshi's fat. But honestly, he had all the time in the world to react to. I feel like he just didn't know which way to DI. Right. Because that's a little ambiguous. Mm. If you've never had that setup happen before, you might be scared. You don't want to pop out on the other side and get, like, DI mix up. Yeah. But he, he definitely could have lived there. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. But, uh... Either way, that was a sick setup. Mm -hmm. And interesting, Game 2 is going to go to Battlefield. And I think... I think this is a really good stage for Toon Link because he doesn't have to have the opponent on the ground to hit them with a bomb. If the opponent is jumping and they're up at the platform, he can cover the platform really well with the bomb. Mm -hmm. Especially because it like it'll go up pretty quickly and then it'll slow fall and they're like, I'm stuck in my shield. Yeah, and then he can again do that insane shield pressure that he does right there. Mm -hmm. Right now, little prodigy's prodigy has gotten a little bit privy to it. <sighs> Two tether, two Ooh. tether grabs with quotes. Mm -hmm. Poor Yoshi. Grabs. Yoshi has all the detriments of a tether grab and none of the benefits. None of the benefits, yeah. It never, it never has had any of the benefits. Not even follow-ups. Not, <laughs> like, not, not in Smash 64. Get not a, in, getting a grab just... Not a kill throw. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. That was a great reaction to the missed tech there. Because on the missed tech, he jumped, he empty landed, and he's like, okay, missed tech, I got you. Forward smash, free kill. Oh, the charge. The charge on that up smash. Knowing that he wasn't going to come down with an attack, he's been throwing those eggs up there all day. Might not have had time the way that he spaced the egg. I really okay. like the way that he ran to the opposite end of the stage to keep the boomerang out for just a little bit longer, keep him from coming off that platform at him. I like that Noah Fox is also paying attention to which way the little prodigy has been getting off the plat. Um, but it looks like he's paying more attention to the spacing of Noah Fox, and it's not so much a habit of I jump to the center mm -hmm. stage. So that's good. Let's see how he covers. Okay, covers the plat and forces Little Prodigy off stage with the boomerang. Still solid control of center right now. Mm -hmm. Ooh, but that egg finds Easy a way to back do on. Like. Mm -hmm. he, I mean, you can just put up walls, chase your opponent to the corner with them. Right, but you got to know how to oh. use those tools. Ooh. I thought he was going to get a conversion over of that. Oh, and the reverse up B? That, See, but now why is he enough to know how to DI that? Yeah. 
Last game, he died at like that exact percent with this kind of rage. Oh, oh the forward air. Not going to kill, but definitely that... savage. Mm -hmm. oh. oh, okay. He's got no jump. Doesn't need it. Again, recovers with the reverse to but try to catch him, but because he recovered with the reverse, he couldn't snap to ledge. Stuck above the stage. Gave a little prodigy time to get that set up. Oh, the roll in. And yep, that'll do it. Again. Yep. See, that's what I love about the way he'll throw the bomb, it'll bounce off their shield, he'll re-grab the bomb, and then once they pick an out-of-shield option, he still has the bomb there, yeah. so he can... Okay, you picked an option, now I throw the bomb, it's a long-range option, and then I got my conversion. Yeah. That's, that's why nice. it's important to not let Toon Link trap you in a corner, because he can put that shield pressure on you, mm -hmm. and you do need to shield until he goes away, mm -hmm. but... You know, then you have to play a whole, you know, five, ten seconds where you're getting your shield back. Mm -hmm. And you can't just like, oh, I'm going to roll into the Toon Link now because then they no, have other they stuff they can do. They up you straight up. Yeah. yeah. There's a lot of stuff that they can do. That's why his shield pressure is kind of scary. A lot of the time it's just hold shield against him, please. Mm -hmm. um, so that all he can do is toss the bomb away and then grab you. Uh, and then it's very reactable. But it's very scary at the same time. Yeah. You're just like, I'm going to hold shield, and then he'll forward smash it and break my shield, and then yeah. forward smash me, and I die at, like, 80. That's why you have to be careful. Have to have to be careful. You have to be careful. Yeah. You have to pay attention to the details. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. That was nice. I will constantly, constantly do my glass and crush it. Yeah. That, uh, that was just really well played by, uh, by Noah Fox. Yeah. I like that. Very well played. Oh, Ooh. it's Sansy. We get a, And based on that sweater, is that... Yeah, that is a dose. Not yes. a uno. That's too little. Not a trace. That's too much. Well, a dose. Two? Two a. A's? <laughs> so, yeah. Autos is going to be up rocking the Ryu versus... You know, we might see Falco. Might see Falco. So, might see Kirby. Yeah, we might see Kirby. Zan is a Kirby man. However, A, he's been loving Falco recently, and B, Kirby versus uh, Kirby versus Ryu kind of sucks sometimes. Yeah. And Falco versus Ryu. Oh, he just deleted your tag. What What was it? Goku. Oh, well, I mean, I haven't used the Goku tag, to be fair, in like two months. Maybe hey, you're supposed to get mad about it. I have probably six tags on you're that side. You're supposed setup. to get mean. Ah, uh, that's me going Super Saiyan because I was so mad going to activate your Kaioken technique. And this is to go even further beyond! <laughs> em, could they hear Thank you, you please? They, yes? Thank you. Good. Em, I love you. See, normally, on, on a shockwave maybe a month ago, he would have made that same comment, but you people at home would not have heard him, and you would have not you would not have known how beautiful and genius Em is. He is a meme I like, to, I like to talk about uh, President or former President Barack Obama's Kaioken technique. Oh, yeah? Uh-huh. You mean the Chaos Emeralds? Yes. <laughs> I do mean the Chaos Emeralds. <laughs> I, don't know if, I don't know if you've seen the uh, the thing that they did, but it was it was one of those, like, hello memes. But it was, hello? Somebody, it was somebody going, like, hello. The water starts to rise. Hello. hello? Somebody help me! And then it's like, oh, and then man. it's like a, just a picture of Obama, and it's like, Mr. Obama, and it goes like, oh, Mr. Obama, I'll do anything for you. Anything. Yes, Mr. Obama, I'll do anything for you. Then perish. Oh my God, <laughs> that is 